This video is meant to show you how to use the clinical instructions tools in the patient visit summary to share important information with your patients. You can use any generic chart component to share clinical instructions using the patient visit summary report and also through the patient portal. This is particularly useful for patients who are managing any chronic condition like asthma or ADHD, but really it can facilitate communication with patients with any condition. Right now, maybe you just communicate instructions verbally or write out some separate notes, but with clinical instructions in PCC EHR, you can make the instructions part of the chart and print them out directly from the EHR or make them available online at any time. First, you'll need to configure the patient visit summary and the patient portal to include clinical instructions. You do this with the patient visit summary configuration and patient portal manager tools respectively. You can choose which specific components you want to make available to patients. I already have the ones I want to show included, but you can add as many components as you want to the clinical instructions. Now that these have been turned on, let's see them in use. Pebbles here came in for a well visit. She has asthma that is triggered by animal hair, but her current medication is keeping her at 100% peak flow, so we're going to have her continue taking her medication at current dosages until her next visit. Now, when I go to print the patient visit summary, these new clinical instructions will show up on the report. Also, since I turned on this feature for the patient portal, Pebbles' parents will be able to refer to these instructions from their smartphone or computer. Now, this is just one simple example of clinical instructions in PCC EHR. You can create any chart note component and include it in the clinical instructions. The sky's really the limit. For more information about clinical instructions or how to create chart note components, visit learn.pcc.com.